G'day guys, welcome back to another YouTube channel on Sporting Loop. Today, I am going to do a city vlog where, where I'll be t catching a train into the city. I'm currently at East Land right now. I just got a pack of lollies for the lads. And, and yeah, uh, in the city, what will they'll be featuring? The only the feature that I know we're doing, we'll be having a kick at AIA, but then as as I go on in this uh, city uh, trip vlog, I will film more features and you know, keep you up to date. And I hope you enjoy this vlog. Don't forget that uh, the Big Bash starts tonight. It's between the Brisbane Heat and the Melbourne Stars at the Gabba for the opening game of the season of T20 Big Bash season number 13. Stay tuned and I could be live streaming though. I might start the live stream a little late as I have I have to go to a verbal career club dinner and and training and but I'll vlog when I can. Here we are, we can see both two sports uh, for training on that ground, the goshes, the Melbourne victory for soccer and and the storm for the NRL. Our train ride to Richmond was okay, except when I got really annoyed when we had to stop for nothing at Box Hill. I don't know why, but but it doesn't matter. We're here and we're AIA, so that's the main thing. The Pies are an absolutely fucking kidding me right now. They bloody took down the goalpost, so we cannot have a kick. Ruined our day of playing the game called Horse. Oh, I'm so annoyed right now. I see. Now there's two things I'm annoyed at. One, the train stopped for no reason at Box Hill. Two, the bloody Collingwood fucking took in the goalpost down. Jesus Christ. We have bloody spent 31 minutes on figuring out what to do in the city, but we finally came out this year. So we're going to go back to Box Hill to grab a feed and play. Could play horse should the post be up at Head and Our Reserve. I'm seriously pissed off with the weather today in Australia because not only it has been heavy rain and thunderstorm in Melbourne, it is also raining in Adelaide, therefore delaying the game between the Adelaide Strikers and the Brisbane Heat. It's it's the Strikers' first game of the season at the Adelaide Oval and the first game of the, this season, 2023-2024, and the Heat's second game of the season. So this blockbuster could get abandoned due to this stupid rain. We just pray for the rain to go away so the strikers in a heat match can get on the way. I'm, I'm gonna cross my fingers and, and pray that happens. This is it. This is the Super 5-5 fi 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 netball grand final. Either geezers or Benny Lou's netballers will take on the premiership this this evening. Ever Jimmy, bye. bye! Jimmy gets the first score in our grand final. That's the start. Jimmy! Ah, oh, Jimmy, take your time. Bye! Jimmy Buckets! Good Jimmy Buckets! Jimmy's getting all of our points. That's what we need. Come on! Eagle! We're for champions. Come on! Benny Lou's netballers are champions of this. Next season. Wow. Oh, okay. yeah, you guys. Congratulations, guys. Thank you, Benny. Here we are, guys. We are now at Cape Shank. Our drive is about an hour and a half. Or oh, I don't know, like, my dad said it was apparently 100 kilometers from our house. So, yeah, so my mum's just went now about to check in to a hotel to see. And I'll do a view on, on how the hotel goes. If it's good, decent, or shocking. Look, stay tuned and find out. So we just arrived at Cape Shank uh, in Mornington Peninsula. <clears throat> There's a golf course there, which we will be playing in an hour time. My tee off time is at 3. It is currently 2 p.m. And we're just here at the cafe having a quick lunch. We have ordered a pizza, a salmon pizza. And I will get back to you 
with the taste test when when the pizza arrives and see if I like it or if it's decent or if the pizza is shocking. I'll get back to you when the food arrives. There you go guys. Here it is. The salmon ladder pizza. Haven't had this. Let's see. Let's see how this tastes. Here we are. Look at this delicious slice of pizza. Now let's tuck it. That is delicious ass. Mm. Here we go guys. This is hole number one. I am ready to tee off. Um, I think I'm 15 minutes late, but at least there's no one here. This is part one, uh, hole one, pass four. Let's see how this goes. Alright, here we go. This is hole number six at Cape Shank. I'm, I'm on 32 after five. Well, here we are, guys. We we're having our first dinner night at Cape Shank. This weather has really disappointed me because uh, it, it, the fog was so heavy. We only ha can only play six holes of golf. Then we chose to stop because my dad said that the fog was so heavy. But tomorrow we have a much better weather to for an 18 holes back here at that course. We're, we tee off at 12 o'clock at noon and let's see hopefully I get uh, I can beat 105 tomorrow let's see how this dinner goes and I'll, and I'll get catch you right this, now it's time for the taste test here we are I'm about to dig into breakfast I want to taste everything starting off with the pancakes Freshly made. Now this, uh, now the mushroom. Mm. Mushrooms are good. Now this grilled tomato. Can you see it? Now these, uh, these uh, hashies, hash. These hash browns. Oh my, the hash browns are explainable. Crisp. So crispy. And, and delicious. No, we better bring it. Let's have some fun. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, uh, the hash brown, sorry. This hash brown is uh, like, it's golden crispy and some uh, of this delicious crispy bacon. Overall, uh, an excellent breakfast to start the morning. Look at this course. This is absolutely unbelievable. Much better weather than yesterday, as I said. But I'm teeing off in five minutes. Let I really, my dad and my mum will take me some photos of some of some of my golf swings, and let's see if I can break 100 or try to beat my current best, which is 108, which I which I made a lot a couple of them in last month. Let's do this. So just I'm on my lunch break right now after playing the front nine golf, I shot 52 off nine and then I've ordered a fried chicken and bacon burger and with some chips for my lunch and then after we eat our lunch we will get back to, and tee off hole 10 and let's see if I can lower my score and hopefully beat 108 my previous best which I did the last uh, month at Ringwood let's see how we go I will get I'll feel more when uh, the food comes holy oh, shit this burger is absolutely dripping in sauce it is absolutely dripping
Here we are just after my lunch break. The burger was absolutely delicious. The sauce was uh, dripping everywhere, but doesn't matter. Tastes delicious. That's the main thing that happens. We are now continuing on our 18 hole journey in, in Cape Shank. We are up to hole number 10. And, and then we will, I will get you some more content uh, as I play. Here we are, we're back at our accommodation after a big round of golf. It was a, it was a good game of golf. It's really refreshing, but really hot. Sun's out, so which is good. I shot 106 uh, off 18, so not a bad score. I beat my best by two. I'm really happy with my score. Yeah, we'll, then we'll go to dinner at like six o'clock. We're not having dinner at this this is a resort in Cape Shake. We are going to Rosebud to and find a restaurant there to have some have some dinner. <sighs> there you go guys. This is my last breakfast in this resort because obviously today we are returning home to Burma. And now I will stream a big bath as soon as possible. Between stars and scorches tonight. It's those stars. I'm a star supporter, by the way. Well, there you go, guys. That's going to be it for another weekly vlog on my YouTube channel where I went to Cape Shank IXCV Resort and uh, had an 18 hole round. Actually, beat my best by two, scoring 106, beating my previous best, which is 108 at Ringwood. If you guys enjoyed it, Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you, you and I recommend you guys to go to ISCV for a for a holiday. It is absolutely sensational uh, there. It sucks that we had a thunderstorm weather whilst we we're driving, and the freeway was, and uh, whilst we we're on the freeway. The rain, uh, were right. the rain was so heavy, and yeah, and I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll all see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.